We are, however, firmly opposed to the current trend directed by a vindictive regime that the president and the president that seems to be pursuing a personal vendetta against specific current and past state officers in the pretext of pursuing extrajudicial executions. Siku chache baada ya kinara wa Azimio Raila Amolo Odinga kujitokeza kutetea aliyekuwa mkurugenzi wa idara upelelezi wa jinai nchini DCI George Kinoti kwa kile alichokitaja kama kuandamwa na serikali ya Rais William Samoei Ruto naibu wa Rais Rigathi Gachagua amepuzili mbali madai ya Odinga Shago mbali uongoza viongozi wa Kenya kwanza kuhudhuria ibada kutoa shukran eneo la Kenol County ya Muranga amesisitiza kuwa kufunguliwa mashtaka kwa maafisa wa polisi wa kitengo cha SSU wanaodaiwa kuhusika katika mauaji tata haujachochewa kisiasa Naibu wa Rais Gashagu akipuzili mbali wito wa kinara wa Azimio Raila Odinga kutaka kuhusisha vitengo vya usalama nje ya nchi katika uchunguzi wa visa vya mauaji tata nchini. Hii maneno ya extrajudicial killing. I want to tell the leader of official opposition we are not going to invite the Scotland yard here or anybody else. Our officers, the police service is competent it will work on that matter all we want is our officers to be professional ataivyo gashago mempongeza odinga kwa kile alichokitaja kama kukubali yuko katika upande wa upinzani nimeona huyu kiongozi wa upinzani akisema amemkaribisha minister wa zamani anaitwa Eugene Wamalwa kwa upinzani now he is correct he is right he has accepted he is in the opposition and he is inviting Wamalwa to join him in the opposition. Now he is reading things correctly. We also invite him and urge him to take his rightful place in the opposition. Kwa kimpiga vijembe Odinga kwa kudai kuwa alitilafiana na mipango ya serikali na hata kusababisha kurudi nyuma kwa taifa kimaendeleo. Kama hangetoka upinzani akakuja kukoroga serikali angesimamisha mambo mingi sana hii maneno ya extrajudicial killing haingeendelea maneno ya state capture haingeendelea maneno ya conflict of interest haingeendelea maneno ya wizi ya pesa ya umma haingeendelea we want to urge the former prime minister please we want a strong and vibrant opposition to keep us in check please mzee take your rightful place as the leader of opposition and provide oversight to our government keep us in check correct us where we are wrong and criticize whatever you think we are not doing correctly that is your work and that is a good job umepewa hiyo kazi na wakenya tafadhali fanya kazi yako na uendelee na hiyo kazi ya kuuliza maswali and we shall take it nicely ukifanya kazi yako because that is your work Gashagwa akirejelea tukio ambalo watu wawili walifariki baada ya vurugu kutokea eneo la Kenol huku vitoa machozi vikitupwa katika kanisa eneo hilo tukio ambalo mbunge wa Kiharu Ndindi Nyoro na waziri wa maji Ali Swahome walihusishwa nalo Na when we had a problem here maofisa wakalazimishwa kutupiga na tear gas wakaambiwa kuna vijana wawili waliuawa wakaambiwa washitaki Alice Wahome na Ndede Nyoro na Mada waende remand wakae huko a very independent officer in DCI alifanya uchunguzi akakataa akasema ile ushahidi niko nayo Ndede Nyoro and Alice Wahome have nothing to do with it mwenye kufanya hiyo ni fulani so kama mnataka watu waende kotini jina ya yule alifanya hii kazi ndio hii niko tayari kumpeleka kotini kesho akaambiwa wachana na hiyo maneno funga hiyo file wachana na hiyo maneno because yule angepelekwa kotini that is the way we want our officers to work professionally and independently that was an officer who refused to blame Alice Wahome and Dede Nyoro with murder and we salute those kind of officers. 
and going forward that is what we want 